guys welcome back to another video and today I'm gonna be showing you guys a really good way to just you know make your house very safe from all mobs trying to get in like zombies creepers anything like that so if you guys enjoy make sure you go ahead and drop a like so I'm actually just using this house as an example um, so if you want to you know download it I'll just leave a link in the description below but the real thing is you need this add-on right here and I will also leave a link in the description below so pretty much this thing right here is going to protect your house or whatever you want to protect just really really good so I'm gonna quickly go ahead and actually put some rails down around and I'll be right back Alright guys, so as you can see, I just placed some rails all around the house and that's what you want to do in your own world if you want to protect your own base or whatever you're trying to protect. Now what you want to do next is go into your inventory, click on the iron sword and you should see this turret right here. So it pretty much just replaces the chicken spawn egg. So I just placed these turrets on the rails right here all around the house. So that's what you want to do and let me just place a few more right there. So our house is looking pretty protected right now. You might think it's not. Except if I go ahead and spawn a creeper in, check this out, boom, and they just start shooting ballistic. So if I spawned in a bunch of these creepers, they will not get in at all. So let's go ahead and do that. And some might eventually, you know, get past it, except they're going to die no matter what. So this is going to protect your base really, really good. Now, <laughs> the leaves are starting to burn because of the fire, but... It's still going to protect your base. Now let's uh, spawn in. Let's uh, do a different mob. So let's do some spiders. And they're just going to go ballistic at that as well. Now the really cool thing is with these turrets, you can change what it shoots. So if I go ahead and go up to it, as you can see, we actually can change it to like a fireball mode, a shulker mode, an arrow mode, and that is pretty much it. So if I go ahead and just put that to like an arrow, if I go ahead and, you know, basically just spawn in like a creeper, it's going to start shooting some arrows. So look at that. Look at that. <laughs> They're going ballistic. Oh my goodness. It is starting to lag a little bit on my device, but it's going to protect your base very well. All right, so this time I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to make them not move around in these uh, rails right here. I'm going to kind of block it off so they don't actually go somewhere. So we're just going to set it right here. And there we go. Now, of course, you can do it all around, but, you know, for this example, we're just going to do it at the front of the house. And uh, actually, let's just, you know, do this side as well. It's a little bit laggy. Not going to lie, a little bit laggy. And let's go like that. And let's actually just break this off so it doesn't actually move. So here we go. And actually, no, let's place one more right there. So if I spawn in a creeper, as you can see, they're just going to demolish it instantly. So just a bunch of creepers right here. And it's just going to protect your base. <laughs> Look at this. They have no chance in getting in. Let's um, try a different mob. So let's try... Hmm... Maybe a Vex. Would it shoot at a Vex? Okay, it's not going to shoot at a Vex. Okay, never mind. Um, let's try... Hmm... A slime. Would it shoot a slime? Yes, it will. <laughs> so spawn in a bunch of slimes. And look, they just have no chance. Instantly, they're going to die. So that's a really good way to protect your base in Minecraft Pocket Edition. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you go ahead and drop a like on this video and also leave a comment below. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. See ya.